a brief moment, the T was up and running again through Commonwealth Avenue nearly a month after the MBTA suspended service along parts of the Green Line. The MBTA announced January 29th that they removed 17 speed restrictions from the Green Line tracks, while shuttle buses replaced service on various branches of the Green Line for most of January. One writer says that while it was difficult to begin her spring semester without the tea, she was able to adapt. I managed to just like walk everywhere, use the buses. The shuttles are nice because they were free, so. But not everyone agrees. One Boston resident says that the shuttles disrupted his usual commute. It has been a bit of an inconvenience for me, uh, mostly driving, to be honest. It's filled with those shuttles and uh, can cause a lot of traffic. It's not over either. After completing repairs on the Red Line tracks February 14th, the MBTA said that Green Line service is suspended along specific branches again from February 20th to March 8th. MBTA General Manager and CEO Philip Ang said in a statement January 29th that he is grateful to riders for their patience as the MBTA and its hired crews work to complete the track improvement program. For BUTV, I'm Sydney Roth.